This is my pencil urchin in the sump. Uh, he's super not needy. You just kind of throw him down here. Just kind of eats. Uh, I haven't had anything down here yet. Kind of just thinking of what to do, and I decided to drop him in there. It's pretty cheap. Just really neat to look at. I want to get a good video of him moving. Now he eats algae. You get some algae wafers. But if you already have algae, then he just eats what you have in the tank. It's pretty small. About a half inch, probably not even that. So he's pretty small. Yeah, I do know he eats coral, especially soft corals. So I don't have him up top of my tank. Um, I have heard that he will eat silicon too sometimes, depending, but I haven't had any issues yet. Um, I know he's cleaned off majority of the tank down here, um, where I did silicon and glue some stuff in, so, so far I haven't seen anything he's done bad. He just kind of hangs out, moves around. It's super interesting. Once again, he's a pencil urchin. I know they do come out at night, but um, since he's down here, he kind of just hangs out continually. There's nowhere really to hide. It's his mouth right there. You have a sump or something, guy. I, I kind of advise these just because it's cool and neat. People like to look at this. This guy's more of like a red and brown color. He has some really dark reds and some really bright reds on his back. 